morning guys welcome back to another video with me if you're new here my name is amy and i've been on a weight loss journey for the last couple of years following the starch solution and using the principles of calorie density um so you've joined me on a very busy day with my babies um and i am starting my morning as usual with a lovely cup of nothing but the biscuit tea mm. I am slightly addicted to this. I was addicted to the biscuit tea about a year or so ago and had to wean myself off it. But um, it's, it was a Christmas present, so it would be rude not to drink it. But I'm glad you guys have bought loads of biscuit tea as well and that you're enjoying it too. It is so delicious. It tastes like you're having a biscuit with your tea, but just without the biscuit. Beautiful. Um, that's what, Oh gosh, you are snotty. Right, hold on. So today is another busy day with my babies. We're going to be going out to see some friends today. Um, and we have to leave in about an hour. So uh, they've had breakfast, but I still need to have my breakfast. And I really fancy showing you how I actually make my infamous cake. <laughs> my oat and bean cake. I know you guys have been asking for the recipe. I thought I would do a proper video. So I thought I would do a little recipe for my cake. So I'm going to be filming this for a separate video here on YouTube about how I make my peanut butter and cherry cake. So if you wanna have a look at that, feel free to go and check it out. Otherwise, I'll show you it on here when it's done. Let's do it. So we've just filmed the majority of our cake video. Abe helped me so nicely and it's just in the microwave, but I realized I want some veggies before I dig into my cake. Oh, is it ready? I'll go and check on it in a second. So I've got a big uh, bag of kale here. I've got half a broccoli that was left over from yesterday and I'm going to pop a carrot in and I'm going to saute this up with soy sauce and garlic as usual and this is going to be the first part of my breakfast then I'm going to dig into my cake which I'll show you very soon. What do you think? <laughs> Does that look good? Um, you can have some. Of course you can have some. I'll get the cherry bit out for you. No problem. Okay so this is what it looks like and it is so incredibly delicious. I'll give you a bit without cherry don't worry. So Abe's not a fan of cherry, so he won't be enjoying that bit, but it's so delicious. And Romy loves this as well, although she's fast asleep. Um, so let's dig into this, shall we? I want to show you what it looks like. This is the texture that you get. Oh, look at that. Let's just have a, let's have a sneaky taste, shall we? Mm. Oh, man, that's delicious. Mmm. It's amazing how you get so much sweetness without actually having any sweetener in there at all. Okay, guys, so I've been snacking on this cake while I've been making the video real quick. And it's really hard to now go from that to eating my veggies. However, the veggies will be yummy. So I've got myself all my veggies here, which we've just sauteed up. Big pile of hummus on the top. I'm going to finish this. We need to leave in 20 minutes. So I'm really cutting it fine in terms of time. I'm going to eat this and I might just end up taking the cake with me in a Tupperware oh, or something. Yeah, I know we need to leave really soon. Oh my gosh. Um, anyway, so this is what I'm having for my breakfast. Healthy, weight loss, fashion, loads of delicious, incredible food, low calorie density. It's about to head out and I wanted to quickly show you what I've put together for Abe's lunch because we're going to be out for lunch. I've had a late breakfast, so I'm not going to be hungry. So this is Abe's lunch. Quick and simple. I've got loads of cucumber, leftover cheesy pasta, some carrots and broccoli in there, some chia pudding, and his leftover porridge in the top. That will definitely keep him going. Um, so that's the kind of stuff that I throw together. I'm literally throwing together in like two minutes. Um, whilst Little. flying out the house. So anyway, we're about to head out. Um, I finished all my food, it was delicious, and um, I'll chat to you when I have some more food later. It is four o'clock and I've only just gotten home. We've been out all day with friends. Um, we've had a lovely time, but I have not eaten any lunch and I am starving. So, 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 so hungry. So, what I'm gonna do is, I got my sweet potatoes from yesterday. I just stuck two of them in the microwave, one orange one, one whitey one. And I'm gonna have an orange with it. So it's just gonna be like a super simple snack. And Romy just wants some of this apple. Mm, there you go, Baba. Um, so yes, sweet potatoes and orange. Um, I know I haven't done any veggies in there. Let me go and see if I can find some veggies. Hold on. Come with me. Let's go find some veggies and see if we can spice this meal up a little bit. Because it's very basic, but that's okay. What have I got in here? Oh, good dokie. I could do a nice bit of cucumber. I've not had cucumber in a while. We're going to have um, rice paper rolls this evening. So we're going to... Oh, we're going to have cucumber in that. Maybe I don't need to have more cucumber. Um, 
And we've got loads of kale, but I can't be asked to chop it and stuff. Um, we've only got a few cucumbers now. I'm going to save those for the kids. Mm, I'll tell you what, I'm just going to have it with some grapes. Yeah, I'm going to go for some grapes. So when I do 50-50 plate, I obviously, veggies are my primary focus, but if I can't do veggies or if it just doesn't feel right in the moment, I just opt for fruit instead. Fruit is just as good for me as a 50-50 plate. Super low calorie dense tea, high in water, high in fiber, really filling. So orange, grapes, sweet potato. And I'm gonna pop that together real quick right now because I'm super, super hungry. This is how you can throw a meal together without even thinking about it. I mean, as long as you have a few starches prepped in advance, um, then you're ready to go basically, you can always eat. Okay, quick and easy lunch, snack, whatever you wanna call it, put together my two sweet potatoes, loads of grapes and an orange. Filling, delicious, hydrating, low calorie density. I would have loved some beans. Oh, I do have hummus, but I don't know, I've got nothing to dip with hummus in. I could eat the hummus separately. Nah, I think I'm gonna leave it and I'll have loads of beans with my dinner. But anyway, um, yes, lovely, delicious meal. Um, very sit and pull to put together. Literally took me two minutes. I'm gonna go and eat and share this with Romy. Okay, it is dinner time. I love those sweet potatoes. I also sprinkled loads of cinnamon on them. Um, and they were incredibly, incredibly delicious. Romy did steal half of my sweet, half, half of one of the sweet potatoes. But anyway, right, we are gonna make some rice paper spring rolly kind of things. So I'll show you, we've prepped everything, James and I. James came back a bit early. It's family movie night tonight, it's Friday night. You guys know we love that night. Um, so I'll show you what we have got going on. So we've got some tofu, some cucumber, loads of carrots, the most delicious avocado the world has ever seen. It's an organic one from Riverford, and I tell you what, the, it just tastes incredible. Um, and loads of these lovely salad leafies, and I'm just about to cook up some of these. We don't have any rice noodles, unfortunately, which I would usually use, but we do have some of these. What on earth are they? Buckwheat noodles, so I'm gonna do one pack of those, um, so we can like layer some noodles in there as well. So that is what our plan is. I'll show you when it all, it all comes together. I'm making like a peanut buttery sauce. I use regular peanut butter for the boys and for Ronnie, and I do mine with PB2. And I am gonna make hot chocolate tonight with the sweet potatoes for Abe and for Ronnie as well. I don't, know, I don't think James will like it, so I'm not gonna make it for him. Uh, he also is a bit funny about hot chocolate anyway. Um, but yes, that sounds super, super yum. Plus I'm having another biscuit tea. Outrageous, I know, but it's just so delicious. I can't help myself. Okay, so we've just put dinner together and this is one of the meals we used to have every single week about a year or so ago and we totally forgotten about it and Abe is the one who reminded us about it. Um, it's so fresh, filling, vibrant, full of so much goodness. You can customise it however you want depending on your family and the sauce is incredible. Uh, right, so this is what we've got. It's just these little rice papers. I know you guys are all familiar. It's the sauce that's really special. Mm. Amazing. Mm. So this sauce is, let me see if I can actually remember. <laughs> okay. So for everyone else, I've done peanut butter, but for me, I've done PB2, soy sauce, a splash of maple syrup, lemon juice, um, thinned it out with some water, and then I did some garlic and then some ginger powder and um, it's so, so good. You could, this would be just a fantastic salad dressing in general on potatoes, on literally anything. Um, on like, oh yeah, if you do like a big pile of um, noodles and kale or something, this would be lovely over that. But anyway, this is a fantastic dipping sauce, super simple and it tastes incredible. It's so simple. They are a bit lengthy to make. I feel like I've been making them for a good 20 minutes. So it is a bit lengthy to do all the rolling, but if it's just a household of one or two, then not too bad. Um, or you could get the family involved, get your kids trying to roll them, get your husband trying to roll his. I tried to get James rolling them, but he is not proficient, so I end up doing all the rolling, but it's fine. But it is one of those meals I'm probably gonna bring back, and everyone loves it. Abe loves eating these, um, and obviously he suggested it, but I even squeeze in some salad for him, and he doesn't mind the salad as long as it's with everything else. Everyone else has got avocado, but um, I would have had a bit, but totally ran out, so uh, mine is avocado -less, but that's all right. Right, I'm gonna go eat this. I'll chat to you later.
<clears throat> we are in the middle of family movie night and I just hopped out to make my hot chocolate. I've been wanting this for ages, so I'm so happy to actually finally have it. So this is my hot chocolate. It's the it's the no sweetener one. Um, it's it is not super sweet, obviously, um, but it's really it's like a nice level of sweet for me anyway. Um, it is about equal parts water and plant milk. I used half soy milk and half almond milk because I ran out of the soy milk, and then I did one little sweet potato like that uh, which i know sounds strange but it's not like it's not too thick or anything it's just like a lovely drink it's about a quarter cup of the sweet potato um and then i just used a little bit of this peppermint extract to give it a little bit of a little zesty goodness um and that's literally it i mean it's so so ridiculously simple so anyway um actually i need to heat it up a little bit more otherwise I run the risk of downing it really quickly. So I'm going to make it piping hot and then go and enjoy a family movie night. We're watching Alice in Wonderland, the old school one, um, which I thought would be fun for him to watch. Anyway, so um, I'll let you know when I do some rebounding after the movie. I'm very excited for my bouncing tonight. I think I'm going to do some more I jump instead workouts because it was fantastic. Anyway, I've got a little Rami, so I'm going to go. <laughs> it is 10 o'clock and I have finished a very small portion of my work. Um, however, I needed to take a break. So I've come to do some bouncing to clear my head and just have a little bit of me time because I've just had babies on top of me all day long. And Romy's not slept and she's been squiggling around. And I just need us like a little bit of peace and a little bit of me time. So I'm gonna do a little bit of a bounce. It might be short and sweet, but it'd still be lovely. I'm just gonna stick some music on actually and do my own thing for a little while because um, I don't think I've got time to follow like a proper video um, and then I've got loads more work to do today. Um, so anyway, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Again, this week is not super um, analytical and I don't have loads of time to chat, but I still wanted to show you what I'm eating on a busy week for me uh, when I've got both of the kids, which makes it a lot more intense. Anyway, I'm going to go and bounce. Um, hopefully this inspires you to go and get a little bit of movement into your day as well, whether that's walking around the block, jumping up and down with your kids, or whatever it is, dancing in the kitchen, you go and do it. Whatever you feel is going to be really fun for you. I'm going to have a lot of fun on my trampoline. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Chat to you later. And bye.